Hello everybody, my name is Dr. Here again with more of these Chaos Emerald Hunts and the special stages. You probably know how these work by now, but on the odd chance you don't, I go through it as Sonic, beat the level with all seven rings in one life, then I do it again as Knuckles, as Tails, and as Cream. Then once you get his cream, then I'll show you the special stage as all four of them. Special stage really isn't any different between the four of them, but I feel like if I didn't show it off, it would give me an easy out for a lot of these. Like I could just say I did every story in Shadow of the Hedgehog without actually showing you. That, that wouldn't really be any fun. Especially because I could just use the Game Shark code. But yes, as you can see here, I'm doing Ice Paradise, Act 2 this time. I feel like this isn't a zone where I probably could have gotten away with either Act. So, I did Act 2 because... I'm not really sure if this is necessary, but... Because I like to err on the side of caution, I want to complete a stage after the fact. Just to be sure that all the emeralds safe. And, because I do all these with cream last, I can just complete the monster boss in a few seconds, so... That was my reasoning for that. I don't know if it actually mattered. The coins seemed like they were in roughly equal spots. Act 2 might have been slightly easier. Just because there was a few that was really close to each other. But yeah, anyway. This part can be kind of annoying with Sonic. You gotta do a nice jump, then you gotta use that little trick that I've been doing once in a while, which you just gotta double tap the D-pad. Usually doesn't have that much practical application, but here I am, he's not like a madman. Oh, whoa, got a style guy. So there's a really sneaky coin up here. Like, it's not really hard to, to get, it's just. It's really easy to miss it. But yeah, there's actually not that many hard ones to find. If you stay on the top route, you're probably gonna get them all. Sonic is by far the hardest of the four. If you can get him, you can get the others perfectly fine. Alright, so Knuckles, he tends to be very similar to Sonic. Just. This level's. He's slightly easier because there's a couple spots where I end up recovering as Knuckles, but. At the same time, Knuckles doesn't have that double D pad air dash, so. It bounces out! <laughs> Not that it was a really funny glide. Or not, a really funny grinding animation too. <laughs> Just... I mentioned how a lot of the characters look like they have silly glides. Like, Cream's looks absolutely hilarious. For the longest time I thought she was scared, but then I found out she was waving. <laughs> so Cream's like, that's adorable. <laughs> Knuckles just looks like he's absolutely terrified. So give me off this thing! I didn't sign up for this. Yeah, definitely glad I covered there. Gameplay seems a little sloppier as Knuckles. It's because I had to take about a two hour break between Sonic and Knuckles because, you know, life reasons. But I still knew where everything was, of course, but. Yeah. These emeralds, they, they're not fun to go for. But I find it really funny because I'm just going to spoil this part of the video now. I screwed that jump up that I just screwed up as Knuckles as everybody except for Sonic who should it would be the one character I'd be just fine missing it. Oh well! Beautiful, there we go. That's all seven of the SP rings is Knuckles, and now we're gonna do it again as Tails. Transition again because blah blah blah, post commentary, you know how this goes. Realistically, I probably could do these live, but ugh, it'd be a headache. I can think the commentary is bad now, just imagine. Tails and Cream have absolutely no trouble getting these rings whatsoever, just because, again, they're all on the upper route. But there's nothing difficult about these. That five monitor can... That one can be rough, though. Okay, but... 
I've lost quite a few runs to that stupid 500 because it gives you a little bit of a hop when you grab it, so it's really easy to miss the spring. Sonic had a really rough time with that one. That rail also always gave me a little bit of a heart attack because every time I would see it, I would think that you have to jump, but no, it's just the automatic jump that the game does for you is enough. It's just really nerve-wracking. There's that curse to slope again, but, you know, tails, flying. That platform to the left makes it look like there's something you're supposed to do there, but I didn't do it at all, ever. Anyway, just about done with Tails now, we got his sixth ring. It's just that one left that you get the way in, right here. That one is really hard to find on the map, on the map by the way, because I was using a... Like for all these, I was using an online map. There's one you can find on Sonic Center that I've been using. It had blended in really well. Like, it's not on Sonic Center. I'm, if anything, really grateful they upload these at all. It's just... It was so hard to see yellow against yellow. It just looks like a normal ring. I don't even think I did find it on the map. I think I found it just playing around the level. Did you know? I still spent several hours trying to find it even with the map. That's how, that's how these levels go. I think I spent about four hours on this one, so... Not as bad as Music Plant or even Hot Crater, but it was... It was rough. And that stupid five capsule is probably good. I'm gonna say at least an hour of that. It's hitting that capsule, then oh no, I've gotta start over. Because there's no retry button in this. If you pause and hit the exit button, you gotta go all the way back to the splash screen for the game. This game has some odd decisions. Oh well, you know what? Who cares? We're almost done with the game at this point, right? After this, there's only three stages left. We're gonna have the final zone. And I believe that'll be it. I hope. I, I, I didn't stop to look up anything on this game. And I don't have much experience playing it when I was younger. By much, I mean really any. I didn't really grow up on Sonic at all. And I think the only game I even had on my DBA that was on was Advance 3, which I don't think I finished. But no, I didn't finish it. I, I beat the normal boss, but that was it. I, I didn't even put two and two together about the Chow being involved with the Chaos Emeralds. But anyway, I'll get to that story when I get on to Advance 3, which will be however many years. Alright, so one of the special stages. Again, this part I was really considering actually cutting out all these but one. But again, same excuse as before. If I cut, if I cut something out, then that opens the floodgates, and I didn't want to do that. I might try speeding them up for future videos or something. Like, don't be super surprised if that happens. If I decide to speed them up. Because they end up feeling really long. They give you roughly two minutes for each of these, and. It feels like 20 sometimes, in a bad way. And same with everything since Hot Creator Video, I was playing this with, that, with the keyboard B pad, because emulator, and I did not want to use the PS4 controller for this. This game has made me hate the PS4 controller even more than I already did, and I didn't know that was possible, but here I am. Complaining about it even more. <laughs> and I'm gonna feel day when I get to the games where I'm forced to use that thing. If I'm even forced to. I, I might be able to get around it. It goes eventually can do the PS4 Sonic Forces, but I have the PC version now, so. Might just do that instead. You know, 
however many decades between now and then. Anyway, there we go. Got Sonic's Emerald. I still find it bizarre that this game counts the Emerald separately. Like, there's a reason why I did it. And it was so much faster as everyone in Sonic Advance 1 than it was in this game. Because Advance 1, all you do is find a special spring in one of the levels. And the Emerald counter was shared between all the characters, so... Didn't matter if he was Sonic or Tails or Knuckles or Amy. There was no cream at that point, but I guess we traded, traded Amy for cream, which... I mean, pretty good trade if you ask me. <laughs> you get, you lose the worst character in the game, you, you get the best one in this game. I guess she's technically slower than Sonic, but not by much. It's Sonic Advance too, everybody's super fast. But even with the keyboard controls, I still have a really hard time running straight. I got 398 that time. That was that was a nice run. I remember that. Like after I got, I just I kept finding rings. I was like, oh, this is so good. But anyway, tails. Unfortunately, tails kind of got down to the wire. He was not knuckles. It was, a, it was a rough battle. I think I cut out like 10 seconds, if that. It's hard to tell on Vegas. Sleepy. I'm doing fine so far. Oh, I see where I made my mistakes. I didn't do fine at first. Yeah, I grabbed too much. But not in a combo sense, just in a I'm grabbing a bunch of things, so I ruined my combo potential. That's why it took so long. It's funny what you learn when you watch it back, like, oh, yeah, that's where I screwed up. Yeah, we're at a point now where there just straight up isn't enough rings. You have to use the combos. I think I mentioned that back in Hot Crater where it was... I think Hot Crater was technically possible, but you would have had to get every single one and then use the plan onward. No, you need the combos. It's your only hope. Like if you can get like a four times or higher combo with one of those five coins, you're good. At least for these last couple, I'd, I imagine the last two are going to be really painful. Of course, I'm still going to be ridiculously good at it by the time I finish because, you know, I have to do it four times. Almost there. Yeah, I told you, like, we get down to the wire with this one. Should have gone it there, but I didn't. Fine, whatever. Yeah, I cut out like nine or eight seconds. That one cut it a little close. Alright, one more to go. Cream, Donut's done, and I, looking at the timeline, it looks like she took about the same amount of time as Sonic. And Sonic goes between Knuckles is an insanely fast run and Tails is an extremely slow one. So. Alright, we've got another average one. But again, but their controls are exactly the same in here. Sonic speed doesn't really reflect these. I guess the GBA just couldn't handle them running that fast. And even if it could, it would be really unpleasant to play. Really wanted that five ring. Five is that a five ring or a five coin? Like that's probably technically a coin because there's no hole in the middle. Just the the words word vomit. I need sorry. I need to come up with talking topic topics for when we're on these because there's there's nothing here. Especially by the time we're on the fourth one. Like, zero poses, no thread. The green 
Dudes themselves aren't that hard. As long as you can combo them. I would have been over right there if I would grabbed that coin. There we go. Okay, we're done. Well, video is about to be done too. So thank y'all for watching. Next time will be the fifth zone. The Sky Canyon or whatever it's called. I'll have it in the title next video. See y'all then. Bye.